absolutely. I mean, it's been unbelievable for me uh, to be able to come back home and represent my alma mater. And, you know, I think it's just all the experiences that I had as a student athlete and now to be able to lead a program and hopefully, you know, have my players be able to experience those things and even better things. You know, I think it's just an everyday process with our guys in, in terms of, you know, making sure that our work ethic, our focus and our commitment, you know, to doing the right things in all areas, not just on the court, in the community, in the classroom and, you know, just having a standard of excellence in everything we do. Yeah, no, it's been awesome. I mean, our administration um, with Coach Kill and now Liz Jarnigan, they're giving you know, me and all the coaches everything we need in terms of the resources to be successful. And for our student athletes, we want them to have the best type of experience that they can have. And you know, we've invested into our arena, into our weight room, into the locker room, into the offices, the academic center. So um, you know, everything is moving in the right direction with SIU. Well, I think chemistry is always ongoing and it's always building and you're always becoming a team every single day. But I think the thing I like most about our group of guys is we do have a lot of new players, but really probably second half of the summer, I really saw them start becoming a team. And it really happened after workouts, um, after weight uh, sessions, they stayed in the locker room, and, you know, and they just talked for, you know, hours after, after different workouts. And then on the weekends, they started to do things off the court together. They were at each other's apartments. So, you know, I feel good about it in terms of where we're at as a team with the chemistry aspect of it. Yeah, uh, you know, Barrett Benson, it starts with him, um, you know, to have him come from Northwestern. He's been in the NCAA tournament before, um, and, and that type of leadership is huge. Then we have Brendan Gooch, who's been in the program for a couple years, and he's a very versatile guy. He can pick and pop. He can drive closeouts. He can switch on defense. And then we have a uh, freshman, Siku Dembali, who redshirted last year. He was a big-time motor, and, you know, he's just going to get better and better the more reps he gets. Expectations is for us to get better every single day and for us to be playing our best basketball through the you know, conference season so when it comes to St. Louis that we have a chance to win this tournament.